Christmas busy time, uh, Jake, uh, with five games coming up in 16 days. How much are you and the players looking forward to it? Yeah, really looking forward to it. Um, the Christmas period is obviously a vital part of the season. You know, with so many games and so many points up for grabs. Um, and if you know teams that sort of go on a run around Christmas, um, gives stands you in good stead going into the, the last part of the season, as you say. Um, going into Saturday's game, we're second. Um, and eight points better off than we were at this stage last season. How pleased are you with the team with that and the improvements you made from last year? Yeah, I think you know if you continue to improve each year, um, you know we had a great start to the season, and then you know winning three in a row really does boost you up the table. Um, and with games coming thick and fast, like I said before, if you can you know put in a little run together around this time where there's plenty of games to be played, um, you know so it'll be. A, will stand us in good stead, we'll be in a good position moving forward. Um, you know, we're going to need everyone, you know, there's so many games at the moment coming up, so it's, it's important that, you know, the whole squad are ready when called upon and, um, you know, that's why here we've got a fantastic squad and, you know, whoever plays seems to be doing a really good job at the moment. Do you feel you're going into this period with a bit of momentum on the back of the, the Salford result and the fact that we've, uh, apart from Hartlepool, you know, only lost one in the last ten? Yeah, definitely. You know, that's you know that's that's um, a very good one to have. You know, we just want to continue to to win games, pick up points as as many points as we can. Um, and yeah, it's important. You know, you know if you can go on a good run, like I said, and get some momentum going into these games, um, it'll be um, it, yeah, it'll be a good thing. Conditions not great at the minute, and uh, very blustery and windy out there. And it's it's probably going to be similar at St James's Park on Saturday. You just have to adapt to those, don't you, in these these winter winter times? Yeah, I think you know you get. Through the season, I think the pitches change. You know, around this time, um, the weather obviously changes. You know, we're used to it. Um, we'll be ready for it. It's the same for both teams. So you know, we know what to expect, and um, you know, we're prepared as, as well as we can. You know, for that game and, and whatever conditions it is. Uh, Walsall come into this game on the back of a four-game unbeaten run. They're seventeenth in the table as well, but their form suggests that they're doing a little bit better than they, they started off the season. So they're going to provide a, a strong test, aren't they? Yeah, I think especially. You know, now with the weather, the conditions, you know, sometimes form goes out of the window. Um, you know, we're at home. We're, we've been good at home recently. So if we can continue our good home form and, you know, whoever we play against, it's going to be difficult. But, you know, we put the hard work in during the week, you know, the, the staff and everyone behind the scenes. So, you know, we'll be ready for whatever they bring to us and, and hopefully we can get another result for the boys and the fans. You um, had your sending off against Bradford and then you've a couple of games on the bench, a couple of games starting as well. Is that just due to an injury you've picked up or a knock or is it just getting getting back into the side? Yeah, just getting back in. I think you know the boys that have been playing have been doing a really good job. So, um, like I said before, the squad here is fantastic. Whoever seems to, to be playing is, is doing a good job and you know we're winning games. So, you know, that's the most important thing for this football club and for me. I want everyone to be as successful as possible. So, you know, if the boys are playing and winning, then, you know, I'm cheering them on from behind. And if, if I'm involved in winning, then, you know, that's also a good thing. So, yeah, we've got a fantastic squad and it's important that we use everyone this season, yeah. Yeah, I mean, arguably two of the best recent performers have been in that central mid midfield position with Archie Collins and Nigel Lartigal and they're doing really well in there, aren't they? Yeah, they're doing brilliantly. I think, you know, since Nigel's come back, you know, he's fully fit now. He's been fantastic. You know, he's a real presence in the middle. Um, and Archie just grows each game. You know, since last season, he's he's come on leaps and bounds, and you know he's really, you know, finding his feet and, and doing a really good job for this club. So yeah, long may it continue. As long as everyone's you know on form and, and doing really well, then you know that this club can only benefit from that.